Good morning dear brothers and sisters and those who are listening to this meditation time the assembly live spring assembly from lucknow and uh, this is a brand new day and you are about to begin your activities of this day and but before we do that let us give a few minutes of our time and listen to the voice of god and so i pray that this meditation taken from a verse in the letter of jude jude verse 11 as all of you know jude has only one chapter and let me read that 11th verse you say woe unto them for they have gone in the way of cain and ran greedily after the error of Balaam for reward and perished in the gain saying of Korah now he mentioned he he wrote his letter uh, to warn against false teaching and false teachers now he mentioned the three names here actually th- all these three names represent um the false teachers of any time and with their teaching and it is good that we as god's people must know how to guard ourselves now take for example first of all cain he says uh protect yourself from Cain's way what was his way Cain was a murderer filled with jealousy and that jealousy and 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 uh, the murderous kind of nature within him led him to practice false worship and for his own selfish purposes and he and his work were more important to him he was not concerned about god or godly ways for people and that led him into that false worship a wrong way of worshiping god and the false worship always leads to selfishness and murder that is the way of cain so guard yourself from such false teachers and their teachings the second name is balaam what was wrong with him he was greedy and he left the truth which led him to be immoral and that means a false mor- morality greed always leads to immorality and so the warning is guard ourselves from the ways of balaam and the third name is kora what was his problem kora was rebellious and rebellious against the leadership rebellious spirit is always destructive because in rebellious spirit there is always false motives So what is God's instructions for us for today? These three qualities in any person must be avoided at any cost. Because the consequences of this is a Cain's way 
which led him to false worship and then Balaam what was his error he was greedy and he left the truth which led him to immorality and then what was Korah's problem he was rebellious rebellious against leadership let us guard ourselves from these errors and wrongs and uh, these are the spirits uh, coming from the devil himself the purpose is somehow he wants to destroy humanity and so let us understand the purpose of this letter warning against false teachers with their false teachings which lead to immorality uh, through greed and uh, and murderous spirit god bless you as you protect yourself by the grace of god and uh, be free from uh, guilt and the consequences of guilt god bless you this is a great day and uh, as you proceed for your days life and activities job work or whatever may the presence of the lord guide you in everything if you are a servant of god especially be careful protect yourself and you teach your people in your congregation god bless you amen holy spirit of god we need the spirit's power and uh, revelation in order to uh, understand and to protect ourselves from these errors and false teachings thank you in jesus name amen